Hey there, it's Tom Corson Knowles, the Athletic Health Coach, and today I want to talk to you about vitamin D and why vitamin D3 is so important for your health. You see, vitamin D is actually not a vitamin at all, at all. it's a hormone, and it was misnamed to vitamin D when it was discovered many years ago. But we, all now, we now know that vitamin D is actually a hormone, and it regulates over 20% of your genome, of your genes. It regulates your gene expression, which is so crucial for everything from your digestion to health to your immune system. Uh, to getting diseases like cancer, heart disease, um, which can have some genetic component to it as well. Vitamin D helps regulate all of these different areas of your health. And so it's really important that you have enough of it. Now a recent study just came out uh, a couple, about a year or two ago that showed over 70% of school-aged children in the United States are extremely deficient in vitamin D. And now, of course that applies to many adults as well. And the reason is, well there's actually several reasons. First of all, vitamin D only really comes from sunshine exposure to your skin, from the UVB radiation in your skin, uh, helps you create vitamin D through your skin. Now, what happens is when you don't get exposure to sunshine, sunshine you don't create enough vitamin D. Now, if you're indoors all day, even if you're next to a sunny window, the, that window blocks out the UV radiations that you need to create vitamin D. So if you're indoors all day, it's pretty much impossible to get vitamin D. Now another big problem is sunscreen. When you put on sunscreens, that also blocks out the vitamin D, so you can't get it from there as well. And then the other problem, of course, uh, with not getting enough vitamin D is because, you know, we just don't spend enough time outside. So if you're not spending enough time outside, if you're not getting enough vitamin D, you're going to be really deficient. Now, there's also another big problem, which is for people who live uh, farther away from the equator. So if you live in the northern hemisphere, like in northern Indiana or Michigan, around the 45th degree parallel, it's actually virtually impossible for six months out of the year to create any vitamin D at all whatsoever. So if you're outside naked in December in Michigan, your body's not going to make any vitamin D, even if you're outside naked all day long, because the sun is too far away in the certain um, angle of the sun meeting... Uh, meaning the Earth's atmosphere actually blocks out those UV rays. So you can't get sun for about six months out of the year when you're that far north or south if you're in the southern hemisphere. So it's really important that you supplement with vitamin D. There's a lot of new research at vitamindcouncil.org that you can check out um, on vitamin D and why it's so important. But they're recommending about four to 6,000 IUs a day of vitamin D. And what I use personally is the Carlson Labs brand. And you can check it out here. Carlson Labs vitamin D. And we use the... Um, the soft gel capsules, but you can also use the droppers. There's like a liquid droppers you can use, and they're tasteless. You can put them in water, stuff like that. But I take one of these every single day, and um, that's what I do for my health because I know vitamin D is so important for my immune system and health overall. So, highly recommend Carlson Labs brand because they're so pure. They've got really great quality. Um, my parents are both medical doctors, and you know, they did a lot of research on this, and they found that Carlson Labs is the best in terms of quality and purity, and it's got a great price too. So, definitely recommend checking out. Uh, a good source of vitamin D3 and just want to make sure that you use a good brand that actually has what it says is in it because um, vitamin D3 often comes from uh, either fish oil or from lanolin which is from sheep and um, of course if it comes from fish it could have some kind of contaminants in there if it's not processed in a really pure really safe way so make sure you get a good quality vitamin D supplement and wishing you the best of health take care